All right, here we go. Question number four in our college algebra homework number five in my lab math says to determine the horizontal asymptote of the graph of the following function. And here we have another rational function. So if you watch the previous video, you'll know that, I'm sorry, the previous problem, you'll know that the horizontal asymptote is determined by looking at the relationship of the degree of the top to the degree of the bottom. And so let's cover that one more time. Uh, the horizontal asymptote <clears throat> if the degree of the top is less than the degree of the bottom that implies that your horizontal asymptote is y equals zero and so the degree of the top is two and the degree of the bottom is 4, and 2 is definitely less than 4, so our horizontal asymptote should be y equals 0. And let's cover the other two cases just for fun. If the degree of the top is greater than the degree of the bottom, then you will have no horizontal asymptote. There just won't be one. And lastly, if the degree of the top equals the degree of the bottom, then your horizontal asymptote would be y equals a over b, where a is the lead coefficient of the top, which in this case would be 1, and b is the lead coefficient of the bottom, which in this case would be 5. So if these exponents were the same, then our asymptote would be y equals 1 fifth. It's going to be y equals a divided by b if the degrees are equal. But ours are not. In our case, the degree of the top is less than the degree of the bottom. So the horizontal asymptote should be y equals 0, and we're done. So I hope that was helpful. If you have any questions or comments, feel free to put them in the comment section below, or you can text me. And thanks for watching.